Cab Lou with Black Box Dyna. And we've been running these on mini bikes for a while, but now I'm going to try it on a go kart. The box comes with everything you need to install the dyno and a sticker for your ride. This amazing little device not only gives us speed and RPM, but a bunch of other really cool data we'll see in a minute. Zip tie the box in a secure place. The RPM sensor goes here under the blower cover. Every go-kart is different, so you might have to get a little creative with the mount, but here's mine on the motor mount bolt, and there's the sensor and the magnet on the sprocket. Turn it on and pair it with your phone. Got that on a dashboard mount, and we're ready to roll. Now we'll do analysis. Ready? And hit it. Speed went from 0 to 42 in about 20 seconds. RPM shot up to around 4,000 and stayed there, which is typical of a torque converter. Engagement went over 100, which means our TC was in overdrive. 10 torque and 6 horsepower is exactly what we'd expect for a Predator Hemi. This analysis used a default profile for wind and rolling resistance, but you can go into calibration mode and get one specifically set up for this go-kart. These are the number forms of everything we've seen in the graphs. This is a time slip similar to what you get at a drag strip. And that's Black Box Dino running on a go-kart. If you want more information, go to blackboxdino.com. Thanks for watching.